Hello everybody, Dragon Rider Jack here, ready to start my next new Let's Play. And some of you may be thinking, huh, this doesn't look like a PS2 or a PS3. There are a few ways that you could tell this. One, as I put the game in that I'm going to play, is that I just told you and you trust me implicitly. And, you know, another one might be, you know, this right here. The Y-E options. That's how you pronounce it, right? Y-E. Right? It's like Y-I-E. Anyway, let's go with the Let's Play, and it is Super Mario Galaxy! Super Mario Galaxy! So I'm a little stuffed up. And, as a note, I am still using my extremely tiny television. My Wiimote volume is not turned down, as I do not know how to do that. My strap is not on, because I am a daredevil. And I will be doing Super Mario Galaxy, Mario, Mario, whatever, press A and B. I've already completed it. 120 stars. I could play as Luigi. I don't want to. <laughs> Sorry. I kind of want to do Mario for this, and I, I don't even know why, because I know how to pronounce Luigi, and Mario, you can say Mario or Mario, but it doesn't matter, I'm sure someone will tell me how to do it, I just say Mario because that's what this beautiful, beautiful woman says in the beginning of the game, and I'm going to pick Yoshi, because he isn't in this game, except for like one planet, looks like his gigantic face. And I like Yoshi, so. No player two. That's a stupid thing. And let's begin. Um, I understand that uh, some people can't, like... Every hundred yards, a comet appears in the skies above the Mushroom Kingdom. The comet was so large one year, it filled the skies and sent countless shooting stars running down. The toads brought the shooting stars to the castle where they became a great power star. It should have been a very happy time for the citizens of Mushroom Kingdom. That was the night of the Star Festival, held once every hundred years to celebrate the comet that rains fiery death down upon its its citizens. Dear, I forgot she read this. Thank you, Peach. And... Mario! Runs toward the Mushroom Kingdom. And you get control, and yeah, wow. You can use the pointer, collect star bits. I'm not going to talk to any of the toads. I'm not going to be collecting religiously star bits like I did in my first playthrough. Because, I mean, every 50, you get a 1-up. But 1-ups in this game are... Like... I don't know. Like dust mites. They are everywhere. Right. Alright, I understand most people like can't keep attention for like 15 minutes and 30 seconds, so I'm going to try to edit this down so that it, like, when I did Lost Frontier, which I'm still doing, I'm going to be uploading this sort of like every other day the last like six or seven parts of Lost Frontier. Um, or at least that's the plan so far. I'm just trying. I just try, I just want to get through that game because I hate that game. Uh, well, I don't. I don't. I wouldn't say I hate it. I would say I don't want. I just want to be done with it. Look at how look at how giant that is. I don't know what the volume's gonna be like. I may have to turn the settings down. I didn't do a test because it's not my style. I don't test things before I do them. I do them, and then I suffer the consequences. For anyone who doesn't know me, who's watching this LP new, I don't have to do a voice for him because he's doing his own voice. Is uh, I'm Dragon Rider Jack. Uh, my favorite games are the Jack and Daxter series, the whole series. I can't pick a favorite exactly on the PS2. And uh, I really like Mario games too. Mario, whatever it doesn't. Uh, Mario, Mario. She says, Mario! So I'm gonna say Mario. Like that. Uh, you can save these guys. 
Okay, I forgot. You can't do spin attack yet. That was stupid. Oh my god! You knew your weird jump, though. Princess is something. I don't know. It doesn't really matter. Help me. I'm trying to help. You can do a triple jump in this game. I'll explain the differences between Luigi and Mario uh, as I come across them, I guess. Because I do know how he plays. I have used him in Mario Galaxy 2. He plays exactly the same way. And yeah, I will be doing two after this. I'll be doing all 120. I'll be doing every star in two. This story actually makes way more sense than Mario Galaxy 2 because, I mean, how are they going to come up with a story for Galaxy 2? It's like, it's been a hundred years because the comet's back, apparently. <laughs> and and Mario and Peach and the Mushroom Kingdom is exactly the same. Bowser is huge. Bowser is so huge that the Mushroom Kingdom is too small for him and he takes Princess Peach's castle with him yet again. Uh, what else, I don't know what else to say. So, yeah, yeah. Man, I can actually hear my controller vibrating. It's like a cell phone vibrate. Russian vibrations in the pants. Yeah, the castle doesn't crumble to pieces in the atmosphere, which was. <laughs> Not thick at all. Mario! She says, Mario! See? That's how I'm pronouncing it. And then Kami Koopa. I think she's like Kamek Koopa or something. I don't know, whatever. I only know her from Paper Mario 1. And she was called Kami Koopa. And so I'm calling her Kami Koopa. Surprising control over her magic bolt. Thank God they don't do that in the real game. Holy crap. She says it again for good measure. And... My God. This will totally be just the intro. And the way I record, if you don't know me, because I realize this is a much different game than anything I've done except, I guess, Pokemon, is I, and po Pokemon, I don't do this. So, how would you know? I don't know what the hell that star is in the background. I still haven't figured that out yet. Yeah. Honey, you're awake. Let's play. Oh, God, I hate this. Oh, I hate catching the bunnies. I am so bad at catching the bunnies. This is one thing that Luigi... Luigi's faster than Mario, so he is way better at this. Come on. Come on, come on. Oh, I almost caught you. All right, the way I record is I record like one giant session... And I think... I forgot I still can't do the spin yet. Alright, now. The bunnies are... Right there. Come on. 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 There we go. You caught me. That bunny had a very deep voice. Ah, in the crater. Ah. If only you hid in the crater. Coins are useless in this game, except for doing health, and yeah. Oh, uh, yeah. Gravity-based platformer, the first one I think ever was Psychonauts, which is a game that someone... Well, I don't know if he's still doing it, actually. Yay! I'm catching them way faster now. You caught me. And that one's a different color. If only I'd hidden in the pipe. Why? What's in the pipe? Another bunny? Man, these guys have like a... Or like the things from Buzz Lightyear Star Command, the green guys. They all have like a hive mind thing. Damn it! Ugh. Uh, I would say this game is extremely easy. I can't believe I let myself get caught. That's weird. Why does that one have such a different voice than the other bunnies? Wow, you caught all of us. Maybe you really can help Mama. Mama Luigi. <laughs> YouTube poop. Oh my god. That's Mama Luigi to you! Oh my god, the Colosseum! And... Oh, you whore! Oh! Damn it. Forgot. Damn it. Not being able to do this spin attack is horrible! 
There's some random times when Mario just runs in like circles when you're holding one direction on the control stick. On that backflip, you just held, uh, was it Z? And hit A. I don't know if I should give her a voice. She's so epic. She is like a taller peach. Every attractive person in the Mushroom Kingdom obviously looks like Peach. And she's in space, so... I haven't actually beaten Galaxy 2 yet. I just got a Wii for my birthday. Uh, yeah, the ability to spin now. Shake. Wiimote. Hold down A to make this go faster. May the stars shine down upon you. You can't make this go faster. That'd be ridiculously awesome, but whatever. Let me see where I am for time. Because I don't know. I am at ten minutes. Oh my god. Shake things. Yes, breakable. I can explain everything. Yes, stop telling me what to do. Jump in this and sort of like sucks you up. Uh, it's like a level. I almost forget. Oh yeah. Alright, star chips. These things will happen every once in a while. Collect weight! I died. I forgot that there were holes in this world. Well, good. I, I did that on purpose, because I need to explain... Oh, Jesus Christ. Yeah. Alright, whatever. I just... I was, exp I was about to explain this! Of course, if I talked to you, I would know not to fall in the hole. Coins. Uh, there's a life. Yes, one additional life. Oh my god, have you never played a Mario game? Alright, there's another Goomba, and there's the last star thing. And I bet you I'm not where the last one was. Nope, the last one was over there. I don't know what path you're supposed to take, but whatever. Um, yeah, alright. Uh, the broken up the star chips, then you get five. Creates one of those things. Um... This guy's in a locked thing, I know. Get me out of here, there's a key. Shut up. Alright. There he is. What's wrong with the key? Oh. And then, yeah. When you do that, obviously this guy drops a key, but normally they drop star bits when you kick them. When you stun them and then kick them. And when you jump on an enemy, on an enemy's head, it does, uh, gives you coin. So if you need, if you need, um, transform. Everyone calls this a suicide. I think that this is just maturity. I don't think they really commit suicide, so that's what I'm going to call it. I'm going to say they went through puberty. Obviously this guy's huge. You can still do this to him, though. It doesn't make any sense whatsoever. And oh look, he has a key. I wonder, oh my god, I can't believe it's the, the big one has the key. Uh, let's just get some... St you will need star bits in, like, other levels. Alright, come on, sensor bar. My TV's really small, the sensor bar's not in really that good a position. Uh, like I said, I'm not gonna be, like, religiously killing every enemy. Oh, hurry, down here! You jump on it, you don't have to do anything, it just goes... Uh, let's see. God damn it, we've been waiting for you. Thank you. Oh, look, a grand star. We have to save it. And you save it very easily trying to rush through this. Oh! If you... Oh, my God. Where is the first one? Oh, it's right here. Alright. You just step on that. Step on this. You just step on them and make them all blue. It's like, oh, my God. If you step on them again after they're blue, they go back to yellow. So, I don't know. Just don't do that. You get away from me. See, like I said, Starbits. You didn't believe me. Turn off the switches. Thank you for telling me this all the way over here. And I don't know what this machine was, but whatever. Oh, now I gotta go check time again? Again? Damn it. It's been about 14 minutes. So you know what? I'm gonna collect the next power star, the first power star, in the next part. Uh, thanks everybody for watching. I will be updating this. This will become my main LP as soon as Lost Frontier is done. I might not even upload this before Lost Frontier is done. I don't really know yet. I probably will. Because I told my my best buddy that I would. My best YouTube buddy. No, I'm just kidding. Octo. If you know him. Uh, 
And... Yeah. Damn it. Alright. So I'll see everybody in the next part. Thanks for watching. I got a grand star. See everybody next time.